All right, now we're going to talk about Author Central. So to get there, you go to authorcentral.amazon.com. I will include the link. And this is where you can create an author page. So I will show you all the things that my author page has. It has a biography. Make sure everything's spelled right, because if it doesn't, it makes, doesn't make you look good. And they won't want to read your book, because they will think that the editing in your book is just as bad. You can include a link um, to the feed of your blog. So um, if you don't know where to do that, you can go to feeds.feedburner.com to include it. That will be in there. And you could include events that you're going to, but I don't keep this updated on here. I have a calendar, so, but this is where you can add them if you want to. You can add a video, and I created this video um, on Fiverr, and that's how I got that. I added some photos of myself, and you can choose the actual URL, so um, that's how I got that pretty Lisa Rich check there. All right, let's click on the page to see what it looks like now that I'm finished. So you can see my names here. I don't even choose I didn't include that I'm a doctor because I want people to search for Lisa Rischek so when they do it will, um, um, they don't have to include the right um, EDD or um, Dr. Lisa Rischek so um, that's why I chose that. You can see the description that I wrote is here. <clears throat> you can see the author updates that includes my blog posts and my video is here. <laughs> Someone made this for me for $5 and then I just had a video. So that's where my video is. You can go to this website if you want to see the rest. And then you can see all my books here. And these are just the books that I've written, not um, all of the books that I've self-published. All right. And that is Amazon Author Central. If you want to add more photos, you can just upload them. They have to, and you have to say that they're yours. Same thing with the video. And um, we'll go to the next thing. So author page. Now, by, to add your books, you have to possibly wait a day until they're actually on the site and then click add books. Search for your name or title, and then you'll be able to add them to this list. Then you'll be able to see your sales information. I'll just click on author rank, and um, this has changed over time. I'll click on all available. Let's see how long I've been doing this. So since October 2012, I've been doing this, and you can see um, that it's gone up or down, and I'm currently ready, drum roll please, around 20,000, 24 now. So as you can see, it goes up or down. I've been 15,000 at one point, almost, <laughs> 16. Yes, I should round up, you're right. All right, but you can see in different areas, um, I could be, um, at different places. Self-help. As you can see, I'm not a one, number one author, but I still um, have created an income. And this last thing is the thing I sometimes dread the most, but I should say there are lots of positive reviews, but sometimes negative reviews. Oh look, there's a new one about my book and it's a positive review. So you can see there's a few new ones positive reviews that makes me happy but even if you get a negative re review all authors have negative reviews and you should not take it personally that is pretty much all I could say about that <laughs> it's hard to um, see your re your work reviewed and it, to be so public honestly um, but I just enjoy the process and I like getting my work out there so people can make different comments on it in different ways. And as you can see right now, there's lots of positive reviews. All right, so that is Amazon Author Central. It's authorcentral.amazon.com. And that is where you go. All right, I will sign out.